This is the part 3 of a tractor in Revit without using the dynamo. In part 2 we've created an adaptive cylinder with a corner attractor. In today's tutorial we will make an adaptive cylinder with an attractor on center. Let's start. Open the Revit. Open a new family. And select metric generic model pattern based. Open. Select this two reference points. Select spline through points. Then check is reference line. Select point element. Pick at midpoint. Select this two reference points. Select spline through points. Then check is reference line. Repeat the process. Next, open or load the adaptive cylinder corner attractor from our previous tutorial. Load into project and close. Select this four reference lines. Then select create form. Select the surface. Select the surface. Select divide surface. Change the V grid and U grid number to one. Go to Properties and select the Adaptive Cylinder Corner Attractor. Select the Pattern, Attractor Distance, Associate Family Parameter. Then select New Parameter. Name it, Attractor Distance. OK. OK. Attractor Divisor Associate Family Parameter Then select New Parameter Name it Attractor Divisor OK OK Go to U Grid Number Associate Family Parameter Then select New Parameter Name it U Grid OK. OK. Go to V Grid Number. Associate Family Parameter. Then select New Parameter. Name it. V Grid. OK. OK. Cylinder Finish. Associate Family Parameter. Then select New Parameter. Name it. Cylinder Finish. OK. OK. Select this four reference lines. Press tab to cycle the selection. Hold control. And select this reference line. Then select create form. Select the surface. Press tab to cycle the selection. Select the divide surface. Change the V grid and U grid number to 1. Go to Properties and select the Adaptive Cylinder Corner Attractor Attractor Distance Associate Family Parameter and select the Attractor Distance 
Attractor Divisor. Associate Family Parameter. And select Attractor Divisor. Go to U Grid Number. Associate Family Parameter. Select U Grid. Go to V Grid Number. Select V Grid. OK. Select the pattern. Go to All Grid Rotation. And change the value to 90 degrees. Select this four reference lines. Then select Create Form. Select the surface. Press Tab to cycle the selection. Select Divide Surface. Change the V Grid and U Grid number to 1. Go to Properties and select the Adaptive Cylinder Corner Attractor. Go to All Grid Rotation and change the value to 180 degrees. Select this four reference lines. Then select Create Form. Select the surface. Select the surface. Select the Divide Surface. Change the V Grid and U Grid number to 1. Go to Properties. And select the Adaptive Cylinder Corner Attractor. Go to All Grid Rotation. And change the value to 270 degrees. Perfect. Let's test the parameters. Change the U grid and V grid number to 6. Apply. We forgot to associate the parameter for the two panels. Close the family types and let's associate the parameters for the two panels. Let's test again the parameters. Change the U grid number to 10. Apply. OK. As you notice the grids of two panels are not aligned to the other panels. Let's fix it. Select this panel. Press tab to cycle the selection. And let exchange the parameters for the U grid and V grid. Same with this panel. Perfect. Save the family. Name it Adaptive Cylinder Center Attractor. Save the family. Load into project and close. Let's apply the pattern into the wall. Go to level 1. Let's create a reference plane to host the family. Let's add a name for the reference plane. Go to section. Go to Massing and Site. Then turn on Show Mass. 
Then select in place mass. OK. Select rectangle. Then specify the name of work plane in the list. OK. Draw a rectangle. Select the rectangle. Then check his reference line. Then select create form. Select the surface. Select the surface. Select the divide surface. Change the V grid and U grid number to 1. Go to properties. And select the adaptive cylinder center attractor. Go to 3D. Select the pattern. Go to edit type. Change the U grid value to 20 and V grid value to 6. Apply. OK. Perfect. Now we've created an adaptive cylinder with an attractor on center to the wall. Finish the mass. That's it for now. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.